Welcome back. Joining us here in the studio today is Gina Baxter, an exercise specialist at the UT Health East Texas Olympic Center. Gina, thank you for joining us. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so today we're talking about New Year's resolutions and how to reach your health and fitness goals. Because let's face it, every year we set it by February, March, April, they kind of tend to fizzle out for right. most of us. Oh, yeah. Yeah, usually the biggest resolutions typically are losing weight and eating better. Um, so those things can be accomplished with some a little help along the way, and that's what we like to do at the Olympic Center. That's exactly why you, we have you here this morning. So what are some ways we can be more successful with these resolutions? Yeah, I think some of the biggest things are, number one, make your resolution actually attainable. Don't set a goal that's so huge and lofty that you can't even, you can't even make that goal. Um, another thing is to kind of have a plan and let others know what your plan is. Um, so let your friends and family and maybe coworkers tell them, hey, this is my resolution for the year. Um, it kind of makes you have somebody be accountable to and, and give you a reason to maybe actually reach that resolution. That's right. I, I know a lot of people will post on social media kind of to hold themselves accountable because yeah, yeah, yeah. you kind of look a little silly if you're saying I'm doing yeah, this right. every day and then you just stop you out of nowhere, it. right? Yeah. So what else can the Olympic Center do to help us out? So we have a full fitness center um, open to the public. Anybody can come and join our center. Um, we have all kinds of weight equipment, cardiovascular equipment, um, a swimming pool. Um, we offer fitness classes of all different kinds. So um, we have lots of things to offer the community. Um, in January, we waive our enrollment fees. Um, so that gives you kind of a little bit of a savings on, on your membership. But we have all kinds of things um, that people can, can use to help them reach their goals. And speaking of goals, some people will set goals of losing weight. So do you guys have any specific programs to help us track that or do it safely? Yeah, we do. We actually have a program that's going to start here in just um, about another week called Light for Life. Um, and that is a 10 week program that we offer at the center. You get personal training sessions. Um, so somebody will take you through workouts that are, you know, just personalized to you and your goals. Um, you'll get educational sessions also that range from different topics like nutrition, um, the psychology of eating, all kinds of different things to kind of give you a little bit more education on things that you need to do to be able to make those behavior changes and, and maybe reach those weight loss goals. Do you all have any one on one classes for fitness? We do all kinds of obviously personal training is definitely a one on one thing that we offer all year long, of course. Um, we also always offer when you join the center, you will get a fitness assessment. Um, that's a one on one time with an exercise specialist um, that you'll do some fitness testing um, and you'll learn how to reach your personal goals. We try to make your exercise um, personalized to you. It sounds so much easier to attain having somebody and professionals to help yeah, us reach exactly. those goals. So if people want to learn more about the Olympic Center or join that or any of your uh, Light for Life programs, how can we do that? They can give us a call at the Olympic Center um, or they can stop by at the front desk and, and, um, and talk to the people down there. Um, they can also go online to our website and check it out and we have all that information on there. All right, Gina, thank you so much for stopping by this morning. You bet, thank you.